What's going on YouTube? Daughter's back here screaming. Says there's a bug after her. It's a June bug. Go figure. Today, we are gonna go out here on a garden tour again. Haven't done an update on my garden in a while, but uh, check this out. Got my Pure Living for Outdoors shirt, bam. But anyways, I'm gonna go out here, do a little tour through the garden, show you guys uh, exactly how my corn's doing since I did my last garden update when I cut down all the, spray, uh, the shoots that were coming off the side because my corn is rocking and rolling now, so. It's taller than me and I'll show you. But also, we're gonna go ahead and pick some peppers. But, just wanna talk about these for a minute. These little shears right here, I got them at Walmart. They weren't that expensive. These things are awesome and handy to have in the garden. We're gonna go cut some banana peppers, some alpeno peppers. Doubt that I really show, I don't, I forgot my tripod. My tripod is at my parents' house and uh, I need to go out and get it here in a little while. But, do the best I can with what I got. But anyways, I got, my eggplants are growing good. My tomato plants are, they're looking huge. I've got quite a few, the Roma tomatoes. I don't have very many of the beef steaks or any of my bigger tomatoes. They're not putting on yet. They've got tomatoes on them. They're just not getting huge yet. Asparagus, I let it go. It's freaking tall. I've replanted zucchini and squash because I got boar worms. I've been, I got some DE, I put DE on them. And my sunflowers are doing awesome. But anyways, let's just go take a tour of it and I'll show y'all what we got going on. So I'll set this bowl down here. We're getting ready to fill this bowl up with peppers. I've got peppers. I got a red one back there. I got these banana peppers are just, they're, these banana peppers are just loaded. This one over here. I need water. I'm getting ready to water everything. I hate watering in the heat of the day. I come in, these are gonna be for fall. I plant more pepper plants. Got another one in there. You can tell they need, they need water. It's really dry. My onions, I've been pulling a few onions. Um, my onions are getting really good size. They're probably about to their max point here, but I got tons of onions. Uh, I got some good onions in here. I've been pulling onions out of here like crazy. We've been using them. This is a gourd. Thinking about tearing it out because it's getting down here in my cayenne pepper. I planted cayenne peppers. My cayenne peppers are taking off. Threw some more bell peppers in back here. Uh, look at my tomato plant. That thing, that's a, uh, that's a cattle panel made into a tomato cage and it is as big as the cattle panel. So last video, I think I said, I, well, I didn't know what this was. That's a gourd. I'm not a big fan of the gourds, but my honeybees. Yep, honeybees are loving them. You see my honeybee in there. So because the honeybees are using them, it's gonna stay. I'll do anything for my honeybees. I don't really care to have gourds, but I got eggplants. I don't know, it's not eggplant. I got eggs on my eggplant. Replanted some zucchini. They're coming on. I need to throw some more DE on them. Asparagus, I gotta let it go. I'll wait till it turns brown and I'll cut it all back for uh, come uh, winter. But these right here, we'll have to go to the other side. These are my sunflowers and they're getting big. I'm starting to put a head on them. Plant some other flowers in here, but they're just now kind of starting to come up. Oh, here's another sunflower. I don't know how it got over here. Okra, taking off like crazy. It's looking good. But this is the corn. My last video I came in, I'll show you on this plant because this plant's best. See how it had all these side shoots growing off? This stuff wasn't but maybe three foot tall. Maybe, it was maybe this tall. So, maybe that tall. And now, heck, I'll have to raise the camera up. Hold on, I'll show you. That's good, that's good, that's good corn. Anyways, I got lettuce, kale, 
I got another tomato plant in here. It's all doing really well. Planted this tomato plant late. It's starting to take off. As you can tell I got I got some grass right there. That needs to go. I don't like grass. Not a fan of grass. But I'm starting to get tomatoes. You see, we got some tomatoes. Looks like I got a red one in there. Wow, I didn't know I had that one. Look at that big old sucker. Heck yeah. There's another one on the bottom. I didn't know that was there. It's great. Uh, chives, chives. Dog turd. He's just trying to help me out. He's fertilizing. Uh, this is lettuce. I need to take it out, I think. It pretty much looks like it's done. Needs to be cut back. This lettuce is still good. This tomato plant's got tomatoes on it. This is kale. I wish I could show you how big this kale was. It's just hard to, it's pretty big. My corn though, I'm still, oh, I'm still pumped about this corn. I mean, look, we got ear corn here, ear corn here. We got ear corn there, corn everywhere, corn, corn. We got tons of corn. My beans, these right here don't look too great, but these right here are doing good. We got beans on them. Got some weeds in there. The weed right here needs pulled, and this one of them's got it's prickly. Anyways, beans, cucumbers. These cucumbers are doing phenomenal. They need water. They look like they need water. Got cucumber down there. Kind of see in here now. Yeah, these suckers need water. Brussels sprouts, I got plenty of those. I came in and replanted these more squash and zucchini. Well, they need water. It's so hot here. We haven't had rain and I don't know when, but uh, it's getting ready to rain here in just a second. We're gonna make it rain. So we got tomatoes. Tons of tomatoes. These are, uh, Romas. Anyways, I'm gonna get in here and pick these bell peppers. I'll show you the final product when I'm done. All right, so we picked the peppers. I'm gonna show you in just a minute, but I have one question for all you YouTubers. And that is this. How big do you let an egg grow on an eggplant? Just out of curiosity. Cause this one right here is like huge. And so is this one down here. Answer me that riddle, because I don't know the answer to it. But anyways, let's go check out the peppers that me and the wife here just helped pick. Yeah, Caitlin's making an appearance. I know y'all love seeing her. She's a lot prettier than I am. So, got a whole bowl of peppers. Most of them are banana. We're uh, trying to decide right now on what to make with it. Um, we got jalapeno jelly or chow chow. What do you think? Guys, let me know. Or we could do pickled jalapenos. We really, we don't know what to do with all these peppers. We're gonna do something with them though. We're gonna can them. If I have to just can them all together and just make something out of them, we'll, we'll can them. But that's all we got for you today on the garden tour. Um, hope you all enjoyed the garden. It's getting hot, so everything's starting to cut back and not produce near as much, but I'm gonna wait till this evening and I'm gonna throw the water on it and we're gonna let it water for a few hours. So anyways, till next time, we'll see y'all next video. You guys have a good one.